at the light on the freeway that I was at, a car came speeding off the exit and unfortunately pinning me to the back of my car. They said if I was anything but two or three inches shorter, I would have died from the incident. One of the best players uh, in James Madison program history was injured in a car accident in Columbus back in May while trying to get out of his car and you know, make a nice gesture for a homeless man. You'd be getting hit by the car, just climbing back into my, just being able to, having the strength to get hit, um, getting that adrenaline, that, that, that rush to get back to my daughter, to make sure she was okay, make sure my car didn't get stolen, anything like she was abducted or anything like that. Um, and luckily she had a phone with her and was able to to use it and get to make that call to her mom. This is great for basketball and for everything to have Davis in the starting lineup. His spirits have not wavered. The positivity has not wavered. Ended up having to be in a coma for what was over a month. But it's nice that they take the time out to recognize the, the efforts of A.J. Davis. And you think about this, what the story you just told happened two months ago. And it is just remarkable that he has the courage, the energy, the enthusiasm to be here and cheer his team on and actually start the game. People around the world, people in my, my city, my town, just being that um, inspiration for me to continue to live and continue to move forward every day. Um, it gave me that that energy, that, that, that drive, that passion to continue to be motivated and not let this thing set me back.